Hello friends, welcome to another video of Hybrid Academy. Is your Google Drive space full or about to get full? We have a solution to this. This is actually an alternate way of saving your files and documents on Google Drive in a way that the Google Drive space becomes virtually unlimited. Let's see how we can do this. Let's assume this is the Google account with which we are using the Google Drive. Now, as you can see, Google says you have used 83% of your storage and it is suggesting a special offer to buy 100 GB. So basically Google is upselling or Google is selling more space to their customers. Now under any free account, usually we get 15 GB of data. And here you can see that 12.45 GB of the data has already been used and this is about to get full. So that is the reason Google is selling this uh, 100 GB pack so that we pay them 130 rupees per month to get additional storage space. Now, it also has some other plans like 15 GB is the current plan which is free of cost. Then it has the basic plan which is of 100 GB which is free for the first month. However, it is 130 rupees per month and on annual basis it will be somewhere around 1560 rupees. Now they have another standard plan which gives you another 100 GB of data that is 200 GB which is also free for the first month but after first month they will charge you 210 rupees per month. So if we see these are really high rates and they also have some annual plans where you will save something for example instead of 1560 rupees you'll have to pay 1300 rupees per annum if we buy this annually. So they'll charge for the complete one year at the first instance. So instead of 12 months, we'll get 13 months because the first month is free. Similarly, they have the 200 GB pack, which is again on annual basis of 2100 rupees, a bit cheaper as compared to the monthly versions. But why should we actually pay to them? Now, there is an alternate way of storing our files without paying to Google. So for this, what we will do, we will leave this account as it is and we will create a new free account on Google using create account. We will create a new account with Google using the create account option. And depending on your preference, you can select for which purpose you wish to create this account. Let's say I say my for, for my personal use. You can provide the first name, last name, and you can create a Google account. Now, once the account is created, this is a new account. You can see you again get 15 GB of space. And this is totally free right now because it's a new account. Now, the problem is that this is a secondary account. So how we can use the space within our original account. So for this, it's pretty simple. Just create a folder in this. I'm creating this and I can right click and share this with the original account. I'm, I will have to type the email ID and I will make the original ID as the editor for this for this particular folder. So the original person or the original ID can actually organize, add and edit files in this particular folder and I will say send. Now this will send a notification to the original ID that this folder has been shared with them. Now we can log in with the original ID to the Google Drive and under this if you see you can see the same folder. Now this account has already been 83% full but if you look at this particular folder this again has another 15 GB of space available with you. So virtually you have got 15 plus 15 30 GB of the data. Similarly, once we consume this complete 30 GB, you can create another account and you can create a folder and share that with the same account. So we'll again, you will again have 45 GB of free data. So similarly, multiple accounts can be shared with one single account and you can access all of them from one same, same account under the shared with me option and all the accounts would be visible and you can access your files from one single account across all the accounts which have shared their space with you. So virtually, we have unlimited space available in the same free Google account. 
so you can see how one main Google Drive account can have multiple secondary accounts shared with the main account and we can have virtually unlimited space for the main account and we can access all the secondary accounts from the main account at one instance. You can also copy files from one account to another. You can move files, you can use your files and we are now not limited to exactly 15 GB of space. And this all goes absolutely free of cost. You don't have to pay anything to Google to buy additional space on the account. Thank you for watching the video. If you like the content, please like the video, share the video with your friends so that they are also benefited with this information. And please do subscribe to our channel. We sincerely need your support. Thank you. Take care. Stay safe.